in our continuing effort to show how easy it is to add human-like behavior to autonomous systems, I want to revisit drone behavior. After Intel's drone display at the 2017 Super Bowl, we want to investigate how hard it is to get autonomous drones to fly to predefined formations. So, starting with a previous drone engagement demonstration, we will use quadcopters rather than planes in our demonstration. We will use the same prior behavior, where we can click on the display, and use that to cause the drones to self-organize, choose a leader, and a team to engage the target. The embedded policy contained in every drone, evaluates fuel supply, location, heading, weapon supply, and self-damage assessment to collectively, form a squad to engage the target. First we will show that our initial target event uses all four drones to engage the target. After you have heard the explosion, we will quiet the system. I have added more drones to the battlefield. And I can click in multiple areas of the battlefield and see the drone self-organize to engage multiple targets. I am using a configurator to change how all the drones think at the same time. I am also demonstrating that I can use radio buttons to get the drones to organize into planned formations. One radio button creates a linear formation. Another radio button creates a radial formation. The keel-based policy tells each drone, how to think, as each proceeds to its target location, where it waits for further instructions. If the drones are released from the formation, they randomly move away, until they receive their next directive. There are no pre-programmed paths. The drones just behave according to policy. It is one thing, to move to pre-planned formations. This is how battles were fought in the Revolutionary War. It is more interesting when the drones generate their formations on the fly, based on how they see the battlefield. Some will hide. Some will draw fire. Some will mount a forward assault. Some will cut off supply chains. Keel-based adaptive operational policies will define how machines compete against machines. The best policies will determine the winner.